it sounds as it sounded like you got some these producers. You had the short film. You got the um, the producers were able to get a little bit of money raised for you to write the script. What sort of stipulations came with writing that money? Maybe even get into some of the development process. Obviously, if someone's giving you money, they probably want to give you some input into the um, the creative choices as well. Two things. I was lucky to have the short that I did before because with the short, it's like there's already something that exists that's visual, that is like tangible that everybody can sort of like look at. And so they know what they're getting into. If they produce, if they, you know, like they wanted to produce a feature version of Mobile Home, there's already a short film called Mobile Home. So they know the world, the greediness, the images, the look, mm -hmm. the kind of acting, the kind of film that they're getting into. So in a way, they were doing the right. And they were also like really good, like creative producers. And, and, and they were like, they let me so much freedom just writing the script. And then I think what happened is after I wrote like a few drafts, uh, one of the producers told me, well, I think you didn't go far enough or like, I think you can push that. And like, but always sort of like very sort of like respectful of my process. They were just sort of, sort of like giving us a lot of freedom. And uh, that's how, sort of like how it worked. The thing is then, then comes production. And then in production, that's when sort of like the sort of the script is being, is being sort of <laughs> challenged because mm -hmm. every day you're sort of like, you're, you're, you're burning pages of your script, right? They, they become something else. And so, but that's also very fun because you, the script is very much like something that's not going to last. Like the script is just like something you, you work, you, you work with, but, they, it, 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 but then it, it's meant to disappear and to be turned into images. So then with the budget and, and the production, then you realize, okay, that giant house is not a giant house anymore because we can't afford it. It's this like tiny basement and then you shoot in the basement. Thanks for checking out this clip from the Selling Your Screenplay podcast. If you'd like to hear the full interview, just go to sellingyourscreenplay.com slash podcasts. Or to go directly to the episode, just use the link in the show notes. Thanks for watching.